How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Brawlhalla for you today as always. Hope you're all having a beautiful day wherever you might be. So today we're going to be doing a couple different things. I have three new esports version 2 colored legends to show you guys. And they are Yumiko, Reno, and Cassidy. And I want to play a game with each of those. We also have the Battle Pass Week 2 missions to check out. So some of these are already completed, like the Perform Backdashes, super easy. Um, axe KOs, Hammer Light Attack, almost done with that, Rocket Lance, uh, win matches, Legends have used win BCX 2v2 Championship, win matches with the current Battle Pass color, and Gravity Cancelled or Slide Charge Down Signature KOs, alright. So pretty easy, and actually I'm very close to getting my Grounded Light Attack Damage Tier 2 Podium, we might even get that this uh, episode right here, which would be really cool. Um, alright, so who should we start first? Um, I guess let's get Cassidy out of the way because I don't really play Cassidy very much. I'm not very good with her. Uh, I think it's just because I don't really play Hammer Legends. That's about it. I'm not a huge fan of Blasters either. Let's take a look at the Esports version 2 colors on these skins though. That one looks really good. I like the colors. I like the shading on these. Cassidy is a good legend though. Like I'm not saying she's a bad legend also. In fact, she could be very OP. If you're good with Blasters and Hammer, she's, she's insanely good. Um, I feel like I'm gonna go Cupcake Cassidy this time. I haven't used this skin in ages, so why not? Let's just try Cupcake Cassidy. Esports version 2. You guys know it's a it's a tradition at this point for me to use the legend at least once if I get a new color for that legend, you know? I don't get a color and then just not use it. That's just not me. So here we go. We're going against Buddha Bones 88 I think it's using Gala Colors on Petra. Very cool. All right. Petra's an awesome legend. I'd way rather be playing Petra, but no offense to Cassidy Mains, but I'm still gonna try to get this win. I do need hammer light attack damage, so preferably let's, you know, get a hammer. Oh yeah, this guy is good. I can already tell his movement is pretty fast and clean. I was going for a, a dodge read there with the neutral sig, but it didn't work out. Cassidy sigs, I'm trying to remember, like, the blaster sigs to me are hard to hit, but maybe that's just me. Oh man, threw my weapon, didn't get the hammer, that's okay. We'll get one eventually. Got it now. I remember the hammer sigs are awesome. I love her hammer sigs. Yeah, she threw her weapon down, which is a... Uh, it's kind of like a muscle reaction for people to do that when they're falling down. They throw their weapon down. I do it too because it defends you against people coming up, but if you can dodge the weapon throw with the gravity cancel, time it right, sometimes you can get a really nice attack in and dodge the weapon. Woo, what a ground pound. I thought she was gonna side air. All right, we're doing all right. We got her into orange already. Feels good. Oh, that didn't work out the way I thought it would. Whoa, whoa. I'm trying to get a hammer down sig in, but it's hard to hard to hit this guy because he's fast. She's trying to be uh, tricky, but not tricky enough. Oh my goodness! <laughs> the down sig lasts for so long. All right, let's get this stock over. Oh man! Oh man! She's kind of coming back here. She, she coming back? Maybe not. Boom! She actually did a good job bringing it back, but that's all right. We still got a pretty decent lead. Oh, oh, here's the hammer attack damage. Let's get the hammer. Man, that neutral sig. She'll just fall right into it almost all day. I should have just done another neutral. I would have hit. The neutral sig hits like, it doesn't look like it hits a lot, but because of how fast it comes out, it hits so much. Ooh, I almost got her there. Uh-oh. That's okay, I got another stock. Let's not forget that. She's in red on final. If I don't get the two stock, I'll be okay. Probably. All right, she got me there. I was playing around a little bit too much on the edge. Fair enough. Ooh, the bones! Oh man, never jump! You have to dodge that bomb throw. GG dude, GG, well played. Oh, she got the level two podium already. 
I tear up on the battle pass. Oh, just the battle pass XP multiplier. All right, all right, all right. Well, that was uh, Cassidy. We eked out a win, barely. I'm not very good with Cassidy, so hopefully I do a little better on this next one. Let's do Reno. Reno Esports version 2, guys. It looks super good. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Fairy Moth looks beautiful. Uh, we got Base Reno looks beautiful. Desperado. Widowmaker. Oh, man. I usually pick Fairy Moth, but I think I'll go uh, Black Widow for the video. It looks so good. Almost looks better than Black Colors. I mean, sheesh. All right. Another Blasters Legend. I'm not the best with Blasters, but... As you guys saw, like, we'll make it work. Oh, wow. I think that's Jala with Coat of Lions color. That looks so good. The new Battle Pass color. What do you guys uh, think looks better? The Coat of Lions color? The new Battle Pass color? Or Esports version 2? Let me know in the uh, comments. Personally, it's, it's hard to say. Because it depends on, like, the legend and the skin. But honestly, I kind of like the Coat of Lions colors better. They just look awesome. The the silver, white, and red, and black. Oh, so clean. Esports version 2 looks good too, though. I love playing Reno's Orb. It's fun. Alright. So right now, we're doing okay. We got a little bit of a damage lead here already. Side light, side air is all you really need. Ooh, neutral sig. Let's go. Ooh, she almost made it back there. She kind of went for the KO on the Axe Ground Pound, but... Look at this. I love the four blasters that Reno has. Hitting the blaster neutral sig with Reno is one of the most satisfying sigs to hit. They're all, they're all pretty satisfying. And look at the range on that. He thought he was safe. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Man, I can't get over how good that Jala looks in those colors. Like, I cannot wait. Nice edge guard. Oh, wait. Still alive? What? Oh! <laughs> Man, good edge guarding. I made it back like three times and she finally got me, though. Got a pretty sizable damage lead here, though. I should be able to get this stock. Uh oh. She got punished. Yep. Boom. Oh, man. I love hitting with that neutral sig on Reno. It feels so good. I'll probably stick with the orb. I feel like I'm doing better with the orb than the blasters. I don't know which is more satisfying to hit. The orb neutral sig or the blaster neutral sig on Reno. They're both amazing. Oh, punish. This guy's pretty good, but we seem to be like one step ahead of me. One step ahead all the times. I don't know. Uh uh uh, not today, Jala. You want that axe? You can have it. Sometimes I like to do his sigs just to get around the level a little bit and do something different. When I know they're not going to be able to punish me, probably, you know. Alright, he's... I feel like this is a drawn-out game. Oh! She got me. I just need to end it. Alright, we're going to end it right here. Boom! GG, dude. Actually, we both went for, like, a spin kick move. <laughs> both. She did down Sig, and I did a down Heavy. I mean, we both basically did the same move. Uh, no GG. Okay, feels bad. Oh man, guys, I only need like 186 damage left. All right, uh, we're for sure gonna get that with Yumiko. Let's check out version two esports. I do have Code of Lions as well. I'll show you that real quick. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. Check this out though. Look at Fox Spirit, right? Code of Lions, right? Classic, right? It's almost the same thing. This one just looks a little bit brighter. Interesting, huh? But we're not doing that. We're doing esports version two. Check these out. Again, which do you think looks better? It depends on the legend and the skin, but overall, I actually kind of like Code of Lions better. Um, I'll do random. All right, I guess we're going uh, high frequency, Yumiko. Uh, I don't really love the weapons though, so let's change up the weapons. Uh, let's use the counter curse bow and let's use the gatekeeper hammer. 
Oh, I might get... Actually, for sure, guys. For sure. I only need, like, 180 damage, and I get the level 2 podium. So that's pretty hype. I wasn't really planning on getting that in this episode, but it worked out. So that's cool. And for sure, I'll show you what it looks like if we get it. When we get it. Oh, wow. Goldforged Azuri with the Umbrella Sword. That is cool. I like it. All right, here we go. Going against Tigar. Salute. All right, that works. <laughs> oh, man. Right off the bat, Azuri's got the speed. We're going to have to pick it up. One way I like to deal with fast, aggressive characters is by throwing out Yumiko's down sigs. They are perfect for that. He keeps going right in it. Where you going, Tigar? Nowhere. That was like destruction, man. Right in the face. Yumiko is a good legend. Like, I don't play her very much because I'm not a huge Hammer fan, but when I do play her, I typically play well. But I think that's probably true of almost any Yumiko player because Yumiko is just a good legend like that. Oh my gosh. Oh, you forgot about my SIG, didn't you, Azuri? <laughs> The neutral sig gets them all the time. Same with the da uh, side sig. It goes farther and faster than they expect. Oh man, the damage. If he floats a lot, I just keep doing those neutral airs, or neutral lights rather. It's a good anti-air. Oh, she did not expect that gravity cancel down light. Oh man, we're looking at a three stock here. Three stock with Yumiko would be pretty cool, but we're just having fun. If it happens, it happens. Uh-uh, uh-uh. If we can get a hammer gimp, it, it could it could be over really fast. Bro. Oh. We're still alive, but so is he. Chipping away at that damage though. Three stock with Yumiko. Oh yeah, GG dude, GG. <laughs> I can't believe we three stocked with with Yumiko. All right, well, well played, well played, and we got the podium. Oh yeah, Fall of the Lions level two. Oh yeah, let's equip it. Wait, it's already equipped? No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Weird, you see that? It showed this one, but it was actually this one. All right, well, there we go. Level two, very beautiful. All right, well, that's pretty much all I wanted to show you guys. So <laughs> I hope you enjoyed. Please drop a like if you did. Anyways, thank you for watching guys. This is Lucian Sword. Hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.